the other week actually I was at Cersei and um, I left the book out and it was gone when I got back. That's Connor Hedzapos, a freshman at the U of I and a victim of property theft, or as university police captain Matt Myrick likes to call it, a crime of opportunity. People who may not normally be thieves may be tempted to become a thief just because the opportunity has presented itself and they can't fight that temptation. A quick search for the word theft and you will get back over 65 hits on the U of I's police department crime log, a log two months old. That's a lot of opportunities. You won't find very many towns of 50,000 people where you don't have some kind of property crime issue. So who is to blame? The victim or the perpetrator? Or maybe it's the underlying mindset about crime on the U of I campus. It's been my experience that a lot of folks either come from uh, Chicago or, or the cities up around the suburbs in Chicago and they think this is a small town America and nothing happens here and you can leave your, your doors unlocked and nothing's ever going to happen. And for our friend Connor, he would tend to agree with Officer Myrick. I'm not as alert as I think I should be. I wouldn't say I'm careless every day, but I'm definitely not vigilant. I'm not on the lookout constantly, but I mean, I am careful about my belongings, but not to the extent of constantly being paranoid about being robbed or hurt. These crimes don't occur at the fault of the victims involved, but some sort of responsibility has to be taken by them for the protection of their property. In Champaign, I am Andrew Muser, UI7 Newsbreak.